Hey gang, it's Jeff from Photo Fitness Restorations, and on this episode of Muscle Cars and Hot Rods, we're going to jam paint the 1968 Chevy Camaro. So, uh, check us out. Alright gang, now picking back up on Cindy's 1968 Chevrolet Camaro, we are prepping for jams. <clears throat> and in order to jam paint the car, we're going to jam paint the firewall. What you see here is we've got the firewall all sanded down and we're getting ready to put our epoxy seam sealer down. I've begun over here on the sides, got it going, and I figured, you know what, I might show you how I do the seam sealer on the firewall. Okay, now I've got my gun. I've got my little brush to give us our final texture. I've got some paper towels in case we get any messy going. And I got me an extra tube because we're running close to the end. Got a fresh tip going. And we're just gonna begin over here and work our way across. Uh, this is all sanded down with 400, but where I'm going to put the seam sealer, I've gone ahead and sanded it down with 150, so it gets a good stick to it. I'm going to get on this side and work my way over. Now, I'm shredding this. I'm sure you're enough so that you cover your seam, but not so much. You're wasting it. Get back to my time. A lot of times, it's going to be quiet, but there is a lot of Of course, this area of firewall is the most important area as far as looks. I don't know what this done. This will be seen right behind the wall. That little piece of paper here, inside that hole for the butter mark, so don't plot the threads. The reason we seem sealed, um, here is where two panels come together, is because in general there's flats that have to like, drive down the road. And if you would just paint all these areas, it would crack the paint, and it won't be sealed. But there it is, we didn't have to run out. We didn't have to run out, so you see where we got to across. Okay, in general, I'm already feeling right. matters because it's neat, not like the show. So Let's take a close up look of it. Now people, this is just how I do it. I don't expect you to do it this way. Heck, you probably got a better way than me. But that'll look pretty good all painted up. And it'll form, it'll function well. That's the major importance for me. Okay, we're back on our 1968 Chevrolet Camaro project. This is Cindy's Camaro. We're in the prep station. We're all masked off and prepped up for jam painting. Let's check it out. Okay, as we can see, we've got all our seam sealer done. We've got our firewall and everything all masked off. Normally, I would paint down into the cowl vent. But because this is going with a set of stripes on it, we're gonna go ahead and paint satin black down in there so it doesn't just look like orange overspray. So we've got the firewall all masked up, including the pillar up and around. We got our wheel tubs, our doors, and then we'll have a, after we get this stuff patched, uh, jam painted in, then we'll have a second batch of stuff to go ahead and get painted up before final paint. Okay, now we got Diamond's TP27 mixed up
color we're going with on this. We've got Lamborghini's Orange Mica by Daimon. So there's the color, Orange Mica. I'll, uh, soon, I'll get some uh, reduced properly, get it in my gun, and we'll see it sprayed on. Okay, this is my second coat, but it's going to be the last one that I film because my camera's getting all orange, so let's uh, get after it. Okay, let me finish this up. I'll get it clear coated and get you a couple shots of it at that point. Catch you then. You guys are going to be the first ones to see it. Let's go ahead and take a look at what it looks like clear coated. That clear is fresh. In fact, I better close the door. So that's the color. Lamborghini Orange Mica. We've got our jams all painted. Couple good coats clear. Ready to throw the subframe back under it tomorrow and get it out of the booth. Had the deck lid in here, but I noticed a dent that I didn't see before, so I stopped it in the sealer. Everything's nice and clean. A few things left to jam paint, but there it is. That's the color. Catch us on the next one. See you then.